What's up, everybody? I am back. Yep, you heard it. First off, apologies for the video quality right now. I can't seem to get this damn camera to work. I'm the most non-tech savvy YouTuber you guys watch. It looked like a little dark in the background. So I've been just kind of, you know, treading lightly here, buying Bitcoin, buying Solana, sticking with the blue caps for the most part. Yes, I have a portfolio of some gaming and AI coins, but for the most part, you know, really just sticking with you know, the blue cap stuff, really making it like a thing where I'm saying I'm not doing DeFi anymore. And I, you know, still feel like I'm standing by that. Drip, drip is, drip, oh, it's heartbreaking. I still have, a, a, you know, a large chunk of drip and it's like worth almost nothing. I can't bring myself to sell it. I remember making videos saying that, you know what I mean? I would ride it till the wheels fall off and that's probably what I'm going to end up doing. It, it's just, I compounded for so long, it's too painful to, to sell it for, you know, a couple hundred bucks. At any rate, I've been sort of, you know, laying low and out of nowhere, Scott the Investor hits me up. Apparently, him and Lee and Keith have created their own DeFi DAP. This is a non ponzinomic DeFi DAP. Doesn't have the DGEN, you know, types of returns, but... The types of returns it has in comparison to typical investing is phenomenal. So without further ado, let's take a look. All right, so here we are, 8-Bit Farm. So in the world of DeFi, where people have made, you know, some really good returns in, in crypto is, is farming. Investing in liquidity pools, okay, using different types of uh, platforms like PancakeSwap, Dex Finance, Aerodrome, Turbos, etc. For those of us that were in Animal Farm, I mean, that was 4X trying to make, you know, his own farming platform. Of course, that was paying out in a native token of, of 4X. And I don't want to go on and on about how much money we all lost because it was all significant. This is completely different. These guys have have looked up some of the some of the big whales in crypto to see what they're doing. You know, Andrew Tate famously, you know, you know said in in the, you know, the 2021 bull run, you know, he made over a million dollars farming on PancakeSwap. So there are big players that are investing big chunks of capital in these liquidity pools and just earning yield. Scott is like he's hit me up. He's like Yo, we should have been doing this the entire time. And it made total sense. His eyes have have kind of, him and Lee have, have really looked into this and, and their eyes opened up and realized, wow, this is, if you're going to be in DeFi, if you're going to take some some risks, this is the type of risk to take. You know, it, it may not be a percent daily, <laughs> you know, but earning a half a percent in investments that control which coins you're getting paid out in, making adjustments throughout the day, depending on what's happening with the market. This is a great way to make money. Now, I, you know, I do a lot of investing in traditional stock market. I do a lot of, you know, option selling and things like that. Obviously, I'm investing in crypto. Uh, I also do futures trading. I don't understand, nor do I have the time to be, uh, you know, learning about all the different DEXs that you can farm, all the liquidity pools and how it all works. I just, I, I don't even, I don't even more like brain room left to, to like learn how to do it. And with what they've created, this solves that. They are going to do all that work for us. So the money that you put in, you have, a, we're going to get a fixed return. It's, it's sustainable. And again, it does not require other people investing new capital for us to get paid, all right? It's literally, you're putting your money in. There is a lockup period. I'll leave a link to Scott's video that he posted explaining this. Obviously, if the emergency happens, you know, you can you can withdraw your funds at any time you want, you know, for, you know what I mean, a fee. But the money that, that you invest in here, they're going to uh, deploy it across, you know, different farming positions that they have. They make money based on anything above what they're paying us out, right? So, you know, some days, some days, you know, they may only make what they're paying us. Other days, maybe they make less, but some days, you know, they're making considerably more. So this is like a, an opportunity to really take part in what a lot of people have been, you know, when you hear DeFi, like everyone talks DeFi and we all think, you know, these degenerate platforms, you know what I mean, that we've been involved in, 
and you're wondering what mainstream is talking about when they're saying DeFi, they're talking about doing this type of farming. Okay. So they've created this eight bit farmer. So let's, let's take a look here. You just connect your wallet. This is on the Binance smart chain. All right. So the way that you, you do this, they have three different, three different options to go in. And uh, there's a pre these are pre-sale rates, by the way. Depending on how long you want to lock up your investment will determine how much you're getting daily. Okay, so you lock something up for 50 days, you're going to get 0.2% daily. All right, 150 days, 0.3%, 250 days, 0.4%. After the pre-sale, okay, these rates will go down a little bit. So uh, this 250, now I don't know about these ones. I, yeah, I think they all go down a little bit, but I know for, for sure the 0.4%, that's going to go down a little bit. And 250 days uh, at 0.4%, you you will uh, double your money, right? So if you put, uh, you know, an investment of, you know, $100 in 250 days, you'll be able to pull out. $200. Okay. That's pretty good. Okay. <laughs> Stock market people are, are hoping for, you know, 6% a year, uh, you know, on their return. Uh, this is uh 250 days. You're going to get basically a hundred percent. So, you know, I know that's not degen, but when you kind of think about it in the grand scheme of things, that's pretty good. All right. Uh, and, and what's cool is, is that it's not some, you know, token. They didn't create some dog shit token, you know what I mean? That, you know, like you have to worry about it going up or down or whatever. It's USDT, right? So that's all it is. You just get some USDT, uh, you invest what you want, you hire a farmer. Uh, this is what my farms look like. So I've uh, just last night, I initiated my first stake. I put $150. I'm probably just going to be using that 250 day lock. Now, what's cool is, and I'll make some more videos and we'll kind of learn this as we go, is that after a certain period of time, you can cash out or you can compound those funds. So there is a compound feature. And of course, that then extends, you know, the, the lockup period. And up here, these will start populating. You know, this is still, this is brand new. You know, uh, as you can see, there's uh, 15,000 in total deposits. Now, what I can tell you is last night when I deposited my 150, there was 4,000. So, you know, they've, they've added, you know, like 11,000 overnight. I, you know, anticipate this is going to just continue to grow. Uh, what's cool is they do have an affiliate program. What I like about it though, is, is that they, they're, they're not, they didn't create for a reward that is not sustainable where only people that, that have YouTube channels blast their affiliate links out, right. And, and basically make, make the, the protocol not sustainable. Okay. So basically it's at the end of the end of your term plan, you won't receive just referral rewards and cash. Instead, you'll earn daily interest on the referral amount throughout the plan term. This approach ensures the sustainability of our project while allowing you to earn more as you refer more people to it. So I will leave my referral link below. Love it if uh, you guys would use it. But again, you know, you're, you're it's not, a, it's not designed for people that, that have affiliate links just to get rich while everyone else, you know what I mean? is just kind of struggling to keep up. But yeah, so here we go in terms of the claiming and compounding, right? When you reach the minimum withdrawal on your available funds, the daily interest builds on each one of your deposits. Uh, there's a minimum withdrawal. I think it's $25. Uh, so once you reach that, you can either cash that out or you can compound it, right? So uh, let's see here. If you reach the minimum withdrawal, you can do one or two things. You can claim your USDT and it will go into your wallet, or you can choose to compound your rewards into a new stake. So basically it will take that $25 and if you hit compound, it reinvests it back into the protocol and creates a new stake. Now I know there is a calculator somewhere uh, and I can't remember where that is. I wanted to get a video out as soon as possible because one, I'm actually really excited about this. I also know that these uh, uh, daily rewards, they're going to go down. Uh, I think it's after this weekend. Again, I need to double check all this, but I wanted to get this out as soon as possible. I'll make a follow-up video. Uh, the other reason I'm excited about this is because we know these guys. Come on. Like if you're in Drip, you know Scott the Investor. You know Lee. Keith, he's in all the, the Telegram groups. Uh, this is family. You know what I mean? Like, And it's not Ponzinomics. All right. Like no one could join this. All right. And I may, it may just be me, Keith Lee and Scott, you know what I mean? Just 
put money into this. Scott told me last night, he's dropping a significant amount of his own personal money into this. And the amount he told me really made me feel good uh, because it just shows, you know what I mean, that he does believe in this and they're actively managing this every day. What's cool is, is that with Lee and Keith being in the UK and Scott being here, the the time difference, there's always going to be someone awake. For my for my uh, one of my businesses, I actually hired <clears throat> I hired a company um, where I basically needed twenty four seven oversight with a project that I was working on, and I hired a company that was in the UK. And what was great is is that um, being in communication with the director of the company in the UK. Uh, when I would wake up in the morning, he would send me a report of what had happened during the overnight. And then during the day, you know, I would keep track of everything and send him what I had when he was waking up. Anyway, it worked perfectly. So I know that that the fact that these guys have it set up that way, there's always going to be someone monitoring what's going on with the liquidity pools. And should there be a turn in the market like there was yesterday, they were able to make adjustments. Additionally, I press Scott uh this morning um although obviously i'm bullish on crypto and bullish on bitcoin i think what we've all learned is that whatever everyone thinks is going to happen the opposite happens so everyone is expecting bitcoin you know what i mean to go you know well past 100,000 this bull cycle and that this bull cycle may go on through 2025 well if everyone's thinking that it's possible right we may as well consider or at least be prepared that the opposite may happen. And I pressed Scott on that. I said, are you guys creating this thinking that we're just going to be in a bull run through 2025? And this is like what you guys are going to try and do just to capture this, you know, year and a half bull run that we have. Or are you prepared that we may go right into a bear market? Yeah, it's better if we're in a bull market, but in farming, you could make a lot of money during the bear market depending on where you're allocating, you know, the capital, if you're knowing when to move stuff into stable coins, you can still make a good daily return. So, you know, this is uh, just a, I'm excited about this and I wanted to, to get this out to you guys ASAP. Uh, again, go check out Scott, the investor. He just put out a video um, that explained this better than I did. I will make sure that I make a follow-up video to this and, uh, yeah, links are in this description down below. Let me know what you think of this. Also, I would love it if you'd like this video, comment, all that. Let me know how you're doing. Let me know how you're doing with Drip. Did you sell all your bags? Where are you guys at? Love to hear from you. And I'll catch you guys all on next one.